it's Nikki. I'm back here today on YouTube with you guys. I'm so happy to see you here. Thank you for coming back to my channel. Look down guys, click it, make it gray. Click that subscribe button, click it and make it gray. Please come back and see me for my next round of videos and make sure you get the alerts. Don't want to miss it. Guys, it's the end of summer. Oh my gosh, I'm so sad. Summer is over, which means a lot of things are changing, but I love the fall. I love going into the fall because there are so many th new options with wardrobe, all of the different things that come out. So here are a couple things I'm anticipating and looking forward to wearing this fall. First off, fall colors. I love the burgundies, the browns, the creams, how that mixes together. I am so looking forward to those color, those fall colors coming out with your, um, your boots that blend in with your blue jeans and your big sweaters and things like that. So guys, look into that. That, that style is so uh, comfortable looking. It's something that I wear a lot and I'm really anticipating going back into the fall colors, particularly the burgundy. Um, if you guys haven't seen on my channel, I have the, the Hamilton Traveler from Michael Kors and I have it in the color, I forget what the color is, Merlot, which is like a red wine color. Guys, that bag pretty much sits dormant during the summer because it's such a dark bag. And I can't wait to bring that bag back out. So I'm anticipating these colors, guys. Please comment down below. What are your favorite fall colors to wear? What do you what do you anticipate bringing out for colors? The next thing I'm looking forward to is over the knee boots. So yes, I have videos on my channel talking about my um, foot surgery and how I had foot surgery last year, how I've been, pretty much been um, flushing out my entire shoe collection over time and buying new shoes. And I can't wait to get out there and find the over the knee boots. I think that the boot, that look is so classic. It reminds me of pretty woman, you know, not quite there, but how she wore the boots over her knee and how that just looks so, I think it looks sexy. I really do think it looks sexy, but it looks like an understated sexy. And you could wear that over blue jeans or tights and it really goes with anything and you could dress it up or dress it down. So over the knee boots, black, browns, burgundies, really any color was gonna look so fabulous this fall. Um, my next thing that I can't wait to wear are my oversized sweater jackets. I like to wear the long sweater or the long oversized sweater that comes down over your jeggings or your leggings. And in the summertime, it doesn't really make sense to wear that, but in the fall, it can look fabulous, especially with the boots and the dark bag. Yes, definitely love that look. Uh, so yes, anticipating that. And also the blue jean jacket. Um, even if you find like a long one or a long flannel blue jean jacket, I really love to wear that in the fall because you can really throw that over anything. So the next thing that I'm adding to my fall collection, and this is going to be a fairly new one for me. I only have one of these right now is a floppy hat. The big Hollywood floppy hat where you put that on, it's like flannel and it goes around your head and it just looks so, um, I guess you say hippy dippy trippy kind of look, but I love it. And I think it really looks good on anybody, especially if you put your hair down or even a ponytail. Uh, that look is just so classic to me. It just screams sophistication and elegance. And you know, I know I look good type of thing. So I really can't wait to up my collection of floppy hats this this fall. I only have one. I hope to have like four or five by the end of the fall. Um, and the last thing that I really am looking forward to is the overstated jewelry. Um, you know, summertime you can wear the, you know, kind of beachy colors, light pastel jewelry. I have a few pieces that I wear. But in the fall, you can really take it up a notch with like the gold or the big medallion jewelry, or even the long necklaces that fall, you know, almost down to your waist. Looks very nice with all of the other elements I've talked about. You know, imagine just the, the big cream sweater and then you have a big jewelry, you know, long necklace and then the floppy hat and the dark bag. Like that really just screams fall, going into the winter. Look at me, I look sophisticated, I look elegant. 
style for this fall. So please do comment down below. What are your fall fashion picks? What are you saving up to buy this fall? Not just bags, but just everything to just have a complete look for the upcoming season and to look uh, weather appropriate, of course, but also looking sophisticated and elegant and very Wonderland-ish. Okay, is that a word? Okay, it's not a word. Okay, guys, I love you guys. Thank you for coming back to my channel today. Please comment down below. I read every comment and I love responding to you guys and getting your feedback. That always makes me happy. And I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.